Dual set up an external mixer. You can use two K2s to route the output from four separate virtual decks into four channels of an external mixer. This means you can use the two K2s to control your chosen DJ software and also use the features of an external mixer. Your zone K2s must transmit on different MIDI channels to each other to avoid MIDI conflicts. By default, the zone K2 transmits on MIDI channel 15, so set one of the K2s to any MIDI channel other than 15. Start by using a 3.5mm jack to dual RCA phono lead to connect the headphone output from the left K2 to channel 1 of the mixer. Using a dual RCA phono lead, connect the audio out RCA connectors from the left K2 to channel 2 of the mixer. Connect the left K2 to your PC or Mac with the USB cable provided. Now use another 3.5mm jack to dual RCA phono lead to connect the headphone output from right K2 to channel 3 of the mixer. Use another dual RCA phono lead to connect the audio out RCA connectors from the right K2 to channel 4 of the mixer. Now connect the right K2 to your PC or Mac with USB cable provided. As we want to use the sound card on each K2, they must both be connected by USB. Your application can only see one audio device at a time, and so the two K2s need to be joined in software. In the case of a PC, you'll need to use a third-party application to achieve this. In the case of a Mac, you can use the aggregate device system. In audio devices, you'll have two K2s listed. Click on the plus icon to create aggregate device. Now click on both zone K2s listed. The aggregate device now states 0 in input channels and 8 output channels. From the preferences window in Tractor, click on audio setup and select audio device. Choose aggregate device from the list. Now set your output routing. Make sure your mixing mode is on external. Set output decks A, B, C, D as shown. In audio devices, you will have two K2s listed. Click on the plus icon to create aggregate device. Now click on both zone K2s listed. The aggregate device now states zero in input channels and eight output channels. From the preferences window in Ableton, select audio and make sure the audio output device is set to aggregate device, zero inputs, eight outputs. Now set your output config. Make sure one, two stereo, three, four stereo, five, six stereo, and seven, eight stereo are enabled. Choose okay. On channel one, set the audio two section to EXD out. Choose one, two. On channel two, set the audio two section to EXD out. Choose three, four. On channel three, set the audio two section to EXD out. Choose five, six. On channel four, set the audio two section to EXD out, choose 7-8.